like to live my life with adventure and excitement. And um, it's something that I honestly believe. On my weekends, I spend time doing everything that I love from hiking to doing yoga to rollerblading, all of those things. I like to live my life with purpose. I'm a passionate person and I give everything 110%. I try to take everything out of life I possibly can get. I try and live life to its fullest. I love nature, I love being close to nature, and there are two things that really make me feel alive. The reason I love food so much is because it's been a part of my life since I can remember. Family gatherings and all those kinds of things always surrounded food and really great recipes. Cooking has changed my life in a number of ways, but I think the most special way is that it's made me a lot closer to my friends and family. I cook a lot for them, and food really keeps us in touch with each other. I think food and adventure kind of go hand in hand. I love shopping for new ingredients and trying out new things, and I love teaching people new recipes and new ways to sort of take control of their kitchen and their ingredients. The premise of the Posh Pescatarian Appetite for Adventure is to get people out of their comfort zones with adventure and with cooking and to get them to try something new, whatever it may be. So it may be a surfing lesson, it could be a new recipe. Just get outdoors and discover your world. Does it matter if I go to my left or my right? If I'm right-handed, I'm gonna turn to my left, right? It seems like that's more, more natural for you. Is that your kicking foot? My right. Your right is? Uh -huh. One of the best parts about the adventure portion of the show is that I get to interact with new people in new places and discover new things with them. Sometimes that new thing is the actual adventure and sometimes that new thing is a recipe that I've made and shared with them. A lot of people try and live a healthy lifestyle and as a result, they cut all the interest and flavor out of their food. One of my goals is to let people know that you can have tasty, healthful, delicious food and still be healthy through fresh, local, delicious ingredients. So I had a really great time with my surfing lesson today. It only took me three times to get up on the board. Yay! <laughs> So what I'm making for my instructor today is a grilled shrimp marinated with lemon juice and orange juice and lime juice. Really great combination. We're going to start by making that, then I'm going to put together a really simple mango salsa that's going to be perfect. I'm going to pair this with a little bit of bread and some really refreshing mango lemonade. So I'm using those beautiful oranges that I bought from Farmer's Market this morning. They're going to be fantastic. These are Cara Cara, and you can see they've got really beautiful flesh. I'm gonna use these to marinate our fish. And I'm gonna use the second one. I think one of the things that sets me apart from other chefs is that I love to mix ingredients that most people would never think to pair together. And it makes me happy when people enjoy it, and it's a, it's a really fun experience. Okay, I've got one of those beautiful lemons from Farmer's Market that we purchased earlier this morning. So I'm gonna give this a cut and a nice squeeze into our salsa. Let's get these shrimp on. It's gonna take about 10 minutes. These look great. This is a little hot, but I'm just gonna go for it. Guys, what I have for you today is a citrus marinated grilled shrimp with the mango salsa. And to make things even better, I have a mango lemonade. So Christian, if you wouldn't mind grabbing your glass. And Johnny, your glass, you're welcome. Here's to teaching me how to ride a wave on the third try. Awesome. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> so what do you think? The two things that I really love in life are cooking and taking on new adventures. So the opportunity to blend them both and do them both in a really beautiful new city really makes me feel great.